Well, when you think of high school sports, some might pop in mind. We've got football, we've got basketball, we've got volleyball. Of course, there are so many other sports making big moves at high schools across the state. Say Living Storyteller Sarah Lehman is here to tell us more about a sport you might not hear Surprise. about as much. Yeah. Surprise. What Surprise. are we talking? We are talking wrestling. Ooh. That's right. The Urbana High School Wrestling Program was a big deal back in the day. Phil Sexton has been the coach for three years now, and he's hoping to bring it back to its glory days, and he's off to a good start. Wrestling. It's not an easy sport. It takes a lot of hard work to become good at it. But one student at Urbana High School found wrestling, and it became his outlet. I just, I just felt like I didn't belong in anything. So I tried out for wrestling to see if I can suit it. I had a lot of aggression at the time, and everyone told me, you know what, you can slam kids through wrestling. And I was like, wait, I can do that and get away with it? So I started doing it. And eventually it became more than just anger. It became a sport. A sport that turns out he's pretty good at. The, the kids that I wrestled know that I'm coming for that shot. They know it. I'm quick with it. They know I'm not going to slow down. I'm, I'm just going for it. So good, in fact, he qualified for the state competition this year. But it's not his first rodeo. This is your first time going to state? No. Good. How many times have you been to state? Um, I went eighth, eighth, well, eighth grade year. They canceled it. Seventh grade I went. Sixth grade I went. Uh, last year I went. Every time for him is a new year to prove himself. Just knowing I'm accomplishing accomplishing it, being able to go again, being able to prove everyone that what I did last year wasn't the real me, what I can actually do. For his coach, getting kids like this competing on a higher level is putting Urbana Wrestling back on the map. The sky's the limit for us, and we're getting more and more participation. The, the kids in the school are seeing uh, what these kids are accomplishing, not only just the state series, but in, in other tournaments, you can see the kids come home with medals and be successful. So hopefully it generates more experience or more kids come out next year. They're, they're special kids. Hard worker, stays extra after practice, uh, does what he needs to, does not like losing. He likes to look at film and correct stuff that uh, he makes mistakes on. A very good, very coachable kid. And as the clock ticks closer to state, the wrestlers and their coach are working on being the best they can be. Uh, right now, we're just, uh, you know, enhancing our skills, tweaking some stuff. Uh, we're not going to change anything. We're not going to add anything. Uh, he's peaking at the right time. He had a great tournament last week, and he's wrestling as best he is all year. So we're, we're good with Cordero. We're, like, so we're just enhancing some of his stuff. And if you're thinking about joining... Go out for it. I say go out for it. Give it a shot. Uh, worst things worst, you don't like it, just find you something more interesting. But I feel, I say... Uh, a lot of people that start wrestling ain't gonna like it, and then they're gonna eventually get into the groove of it. I mean, I didn't, I didn't start off knowing everything. I, I eventually got good at it and became something good for me. I feel like those kids should go out there and try it. All right, well, this weekend, Cordaro will hit the mat and compete at State, which is happening here at the State Farm Center. I'll have that information over on our website, ciliving.tv. And I know that you ladies just love watching wrestling, so don't worry, because I have another great wrestling story next week. Actually, another Urbana High School wrestler is going to State. This one, though, she is making history. That awesome. is awesome. I can't wait to hear it. Yeah. Good yeah. luck to all of our local wrestlers yes. competing this yes. weekend. Absolutely. All right,